people like to make it seem when you first come to college, that college is gonna be the best time of your life and you're gonna make so many friends. So I just found out that I am accepted at NYU. So this is a crazy moment. So I was accepted, which means I will be going there starting in January. We made it to New York, yay! And I have transfer orientation today. My first day of class, this is over, and it was a long day. This is the hardest video I will ever have to make. I got the internship. I'm so pumped right now. Hey friends, welcome back to my channel, and today's video is super special because it is my 100th video and marks my one year anniversary on YouTube. So I just decided to sit down and talk to you guys because I wanted to like kind of reflect on the past year uh, because a year ago is also when I decided to transfer and move to New York and it's just incredible to me how much I've changed in the last year and how much I've grown like on this platform but just also personally. So I just wanted to sit down and talk to you a little bit. I made a list on my phone of all the things I've been thinking about because like there were several different things I wanted to talk about and I want to make sure I didn't miss anything. So I guess the first thing is like a year ago I was in the process of deciding to transfer and applying to NYU. I had no idea if I was going to get in. I had no idea if I was going to be moving to New York in like a few months and clearly as you all know that happened and it was just so exciting but it's just so weird to think like a year ago I didn't even know if I was gonna be moving here and now I just have been living here for 10 months and I, I just I love the city more than I ever could have imagined I had no idea even when I got in I was like am I gonna love it there am I gonna hate it I have no idea because New York is a very distinct place and I had never lived in New York before so I didn't know whether I was going to love it or not but I took the chance and it was the chance of a lifetime because I have absolutely no regrets about moving here I love it I mean it changed my life and I also think starting my YouTube channel changed my life too because I have just found a love for creating videos and just like photography videography I have such a passion for those and I've loved YouTube for years and it's just been so great to be able to be on the other side of like creating videos and um, I just never anticipated when I started this channel it was a really spur of the moment thing I'd wanted to create a channel for years and I just felt like I was so alone and I just wanted to talk about what I was feeling and like talking about transferring because I just felt like I didn't know who to talk to about it like no one I knew like super close was like someone who had transferred so that's where like I kind of found this space for myself that I could talk about transferring I like did this through YouTube and so many of you out there have reached out to me have told me like you want to transfer or you want to go to NYU and I just never anticipated how much my story would resonate with people and that is where it's like so powerful and I'm just so grateful that I started this YouTube channel when I did I never could have plan to time it the way I did and like just like the whole process of transferring being documented like I never anticipated that when I started it it was a really spur of the moment thing and it just worked out so perfectly like I just am in awe still like how well it worked out like to just transition my move and like all of that and just like make this channel about you know you can change your life if you want to and like you can you know move to New York if you want to you can transfer schools if you want to and like it's gonna work out so I'm just so incredibly thankful that as much as sometimes I regret like not starting my channel sooner because like there's so many people who have been on YouTube for years and are so successful um, and I'm just like still pretty new at it but I do think like the way I timed it just like worked out so well for what my content is like and what my channel is all about and sharing my story with you all which is really exciting. I feel like YouTube as a platform have, has changed my life like when I first found YouTube when I was I think it was like when I was a freshman in high school I just felt so understood and like 
just like i don't know it's just such an amazing platform to connect with people you don't meet in real life and like people with similar interests and there's just nothing else like it and i am just so grateful that like this platform exists and like i can share my story with you all and it can connect with so many of you and so many of you reach out to me which is my absolute favorite thing to ask me questions about nyu ask me questions about transferring and just my experience and i just think it's so incredible so i just i'm so grateful for this opportunity to connect with you all and for each of you um and i just feel like i've grown so much like in my editing and my filming like the clips that i have from like a year ago that i mean they're still public on my channel are just like <laughs> totally like not very good and i've just like grown so much in my filming and i still have so much like to grow in i think um because like i am kind of limited in like what equipment i can purchase and all of that but like just like with what i have I, I feel like i've grown so much and i think it's just been such an amazing journey and there's still so much more to come and i didn't realize how much i loved filming like i was already into photography when i started my channel but i just love the process of filming and creating videos and creating content in general like and so um i'm pretty sure i'm going to pursue doing an internship next semester where i can work on video stuff a little bit more um that's my goal and i was offered an internship for this week actually and it's with a documentary filmmaker so like i'm hoping that's gonna work out because i just love filmmaking and youtube like i didn't know whether i was actually gonna like it when i like was creating videos i wasn't sure if it was something i would start and then just like not really do it but i don't see myself stopping anytime soon i love it and i just want to continue pushing myself on this platform you know, as long as people actually even if people don't watch but like i love when people watch but like i just like to create and so it's just incredible that this platform exists Sorry, this video is probably a little bit all over the place, but um, I also wanted to touch on just like NYU and everything. Um, yeah, just like a year ago, it's just amazing that I wasn't even at NYU, and now I'm just like so used to NYU and like so ready to graduate, which is like, I don't know, I'm just like on an accelerated path, I guess I'm pretty mature for my age, and even though I'm only 20, I'm like ready to graduate. <laughs> Um, so yeah, my plan is to graduate in May, if you don't know, I'm graduating a year early. Um, uh, still, things are still, like, not completely 100%, but, um, like, my advisor is pretty set, like, you can graduate in May, like, we're gonna make it work. Um, so, as, if all goes this plan, I'm gonna be out of here in, what is that, like, seven months or something, which is just mind-blowing a little bit, like, uh, also terrifying, but just, like, the fact that so much has changed in a year, like, a year ago, I wasn't even at NYU, and now I'm gonna be graduating soon with an NYU degree, like, oh, it's incredible, and to just, like, have come here and, like, I guess, like, career-wise, I feel like I've learned so much, like, I'm in, like, I have a, so much of a better idea than I did, even a few months ago of what I want to do, I'm still figuring it out, and, like, I don't want to put myself in a box, but, um, just being able to explore, journalism and media here has been amazing i could have never had those opportunities if i, had, if I hadn't moved here and um it's just been great to like try to figure out what i want to do and try and make connections and all of that so i definitely want to keep living in new york i don't want to leave new york i love it here um as you all know because i talk about it all the time but it's just <laughs> So amazing to have moved here and I still have these moments like I thought these moments would have gone away by now I'm not sure they ever will actually but I just like have these moments of awe I'll like be walking down the street and just be like wow I live in New York and amidst the stress of everything like because there's a lot of stress and just like those moments of I live in New York they just make it worth it like all the stress all you know the transferring and the just moving my life and not knowing what i was going to be doing and like whether things would work out how i wanted them to and you know all the different caveats of that and my mental health and everything it's like no i live in new york like at the end of the day i live in new york and that just somehow makes things worth it for me because i love it here so much and it's just incredible and it's just i think fueled my passions even more because there's just so many highly motivated people here and i just love photographing hair as you all know if you follow me on instagram it's just like everywhere i look there's inspiration and people doing inspiring things which want to make me want to pursue my passions even more and push myself even more so it's just such an amazing place to live and i just 
I'm so glad a year ago I was like, you know what, I'm not happy here. I am going to move to New York. And I had no idea if it was going to work, and it did. And I just am still like in awe, I guess, that it worked and I get to live here. And I hope I never lose that awe because it is just such an amazing feeling to walk down the city streets and know that I live here. And that there's just, there's just so much here that's amazing and unlike anywhere else in the world. I mean, it's just amazing how much can change in a year, two years, three years, four years. Like, I have just changed so much in the last few years. Like, high school me feels like eons ago, and even freshman year me feels like eons ago. Um, so I have no idea where I will be a year from now. Like I said, I'll probably be graduated and doing something <laughs> career-wise, I hope that's like sustainable like so I can live in New York I have no idea what that will look like and where I will be what my content will be like once I leave NYU because I know so many of you watching for NYU um, but I hope you continue on this journey with me and I really appreciate each and every one of you who have subscribed who have watched my videos who have commented who have liked who have followed me on Instagram who just have been invested in my journey even if you don't know me um, especially if you don't know me because like that just means the world to me um, just each and every one of you taking the time out of your day. There are so many YouTubers out there, so I really just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart, like, that you care enough to watch my videos and all of that. Um, it really just means so much to me, and I hope you continue to, you know, enjoy my content and you know i want to make it what you all want to a certain extent as well like that's part of why i love this so much is the interaction from you all and hearing your feedback hearing how i can help you through my own journey and sharing that with you so yes i just appreciate each of you so much and i want to say a big thank you so yeah i think that is about it i hope you enjoyed hearing a little bit about me reflecting in the past year and I hope you enjoy continuing to see me grow into the future, into the next year. So, who knows where this journey is headed, but you all are on it with me, which is one of the best things that's happened to me. So, I am so grateful, and I will see you all in my next video.